If you not subscribed to Stella Gang yet, what you waiting for? Come on, join the squad, man. Stella Gang got the city hot. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you notified every time I drop a new video, man. BMG got the city hot. Y'all niggas know what's going on, man. What's good, Stella Gang? It's your boy, Class, and you are now tuned into the Realist Reaction channel on the tube. I need everyone to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. Today I'm going to be doing a reaction to police brutality or whatever. Someone sent me this video and they said I should react to it. So I'm going to I'm gonna watch it with y'all right now and see what's going on in this video and shit and why they wanted me to react to it. It, it gotta be good if they sending me this shit. You know what I mean? They saying, like, basically, because I was, like, what I've been talking about on my channel as of late, like, my lives and shit, shit. Like, certain conversations that I've been having or whatever, I guess this, they feel like, you know what I mean? This go with what I was talking about. So, let's watch it and see what's going on. Nigga said, nigga said, I just came from court. This nigga don't even got no shirt on. This nigga just came from court. Where your shirt at, fam? That's how you went to court. He just came from court. He just came from court. He just came from court. Yo, you know, Paul, like, when people yell at you, does is it just me or doesn't that shit make you uncomfortable? Like when police or anybody just yell at you, it make you like it is make you get enraged. Like yo, like you feel what I'm saying? Like when the police be doing all that screaming shit, like they make the situation unsettled. You feel what I'm saying? Keep your hands up. Do not, do not. Keep, your hands up. Keep your hands up. He got his hands in his pocket. Putting his hands in his pocket and all that. Oh, he gave his property to give it to his girl. He just he's complying and he just keeps saying he came from court. He obviously got his children. Shorty out there with the kids, like she got one hanging down, the other one, the other one over there with his pimples on and shit. He chilling. He don't even know what's going on. He like, oh, the police over again. <laughs> he, he see like he see them all the time. The kids don't even look that friend. Oh my oh. god! They boomed them. But hold up, peep how the peep how the baby did the little the little step back though. Peep the baby when the ba yo the baby is a hood nigga, bro. That's a hood nigga right there. You, yo, watch how the baby step back. That baby a thug. He probably got the strap tucked in his pamper and all that. Oh my god! Oh, you see your baby? Oh shit! Oh, let me get up. Let me get up out of here. Oh shit! They just shot my dad. God damn! I'm not sure if that's my dad, but shit. <laughs> nah, let me stop. Let, let, let. You know I always gotta make a joke. It don't matter what reaction or how serious it is. I always gotta make a joke. Oh my god! Nah, that step back right there. Got it. Oh my god! Oh, now they ain't shoot him with a um real bullet. They look like they shoot shot him with one of them rubber bullet shit. Cause I don't see no blood in there. No, 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 He's still worried. That's a, that's that's a that's a good pass right there too, cause he's still worried about his kids and his shorty safety. Cause he keep telling him go in the house, go in the house. Oh. Shorty just shorty just screaming, making mad noise. Like, I hate when people be doing that shit. Like yo, he didn't get shot with a real gun. Like 
Be quiet. That is. Oh my god! Nah, now they just, you see, that's why I don't like with the police. No funny shit. This is the type of shit I don't like with the police. Because what was the point of the second shot? It wasn't no point in the first shot in the first place. But what's the point of the second shot? He on the ground. First of all, dude has no shirt on. All right, he got shorts on, right? He took whatever. I feel like these police know this guy. They, they probably know him. They probably had run-ins with each other already. But anyway, he went in his pocket. Took his belongings out of his pocket, gave it to his shorty, whoever that is in the video, gave it to her. They did not shoot. And his back was turned to them. So he could have been getting a weapon out of his pocket. They didn't shoot. Okay, he turns around, puts his hands up, then they shoot. What's the point? Why'd you shoot in the first place? The nigga ain't reach for nothing. Now he on the floor. Now I mean, he's in pain, you dickhead. I wonder if they make these cops get shot by these rubber bullets and shit. Like, so they know how that shit feel. Because you fucking asshole. If you get shot by one of them shits, you're going to be rolling around too. That shit hurts. And then the first shot looked like it hit him in the stomach. So it probably knocked the wind out of him. You feel me? He rolling around. It hurts. Obviously. You feel me? How you want to shoot somebody with some shit like that and expect them to not curl up or or just stay still? Yo, what do you, what do you, what do you think this is? Like... Niggas on, 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 a, on a mountain of coke to not feel it or something? Like, what's wrong with y'all niggas? Why would you shoot them the second time on the floor? That's what make people hate cops. And then you got these you got these black people, right? That are so foolish and so so much of a coon that they want likes on social media. So they'll say, oh, yo, well, he should have never did that. Because if he would have never did that, they would have never did that. All right, first of all, first of all, Police are trained. They're supposed... I, I didn't watch police tase these drunk-ass, high-ass white dudes. I'm not coming for white people or nothing like that. I'm just saying. I'm using... Because I'm trying to show y'all why black people don't get treated fairly. These white dudes be off drugs or whatever. Be high as shit. Or they just nuts. They get shot with the taser. Take it off. <laughs> Like, I gotta put some Dragon Ball Z shit or some shit. <laughs> Niggas be making mad noise. <gasps> and charge at the police, try to attack them and all that shit. The police be running away from these dudes. This is real life shit. We see it on videos all the time. The police be running away from these dudes to avoid shooting them and killing them or whatever. Or they'll even taste them again. Why is the first thing you do when you come to a black dude, you want to shoot him? This guy has no shirt on. So... If he was concealed carrying, you would, you would, you would have, how fuck he gonna conceal carry unless he got in his pocket in the first place, right? He clearly emptied his pockets out. Y'all could clearly see he's not reaching for anything. Why did y'all shoot him twice? Let's see what happens next time. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Again! Again! Why are they shooting him so many times? It's like they're, they're, they're shooting him for recreation. You feel me? These little rubber bullet guns now, they're like, all right, you know what? They're protesting because we shooting and kill them. All right, they took away our fun. All right, these rubber bullets can't kill them, but they'll hurt like a motherfucker. Bam! Let's just shoot them and, and, and enjoy. When we go back to the precinct, we're going to talk about this shit. Yeah, shit. Yeah, I caught him the first time. You seen how I shot him right in the stomach? I told you my aim was better than yours, Bob. Yeah, yeah next time I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to shoot him in the fucking face. Like, they had these conversations and laugh at the precinct because... This shit right here, I sound like, I sound, what, what movie that, no, I sound like Mike Epps and shit. Not Mike Epps, fucking, um, it's a little short, Cat Williams and shit, just not. This type of shit is a big police. Just walk, just walk. That nigga hurt right now. And he's complying with them. Shut the fuck up, shorty. Like, shorty gave me tight, like.
Shorty's not trying to get shot. The other shorty, she like, nah, hold on. They not finna be sure me. I'm not going down there. I'm not doing nothing. But anyway, though, like, I don't, like, I really disagree with, with all the things that's been going on right now, with the police doing to people and all that, because I've been a victim of police harassment and all that shit before. Like, I done, I done went through all that shit where the police would see you. Once they arrest you once, especially if they arrest you for something that you beat, whatever they arrest you for, you beat the case or something, it's like they got a vendetta with you from that day on. You feel me? Now they're like, oh, I didn't catch you last time. I'm going to make sure I catch you. I'm going to make sure. Like, it's like they try to, you feel what I'm saying? And that shit is not cool, bro. I don't know if it's like, I'm not sure if it's like a record for the precinct, how many people they arrest and they actually do time because of that arrest or something. I don't know if, if, if that's something in there. And I don't know. Now, I mean, like if they hold some type of record, like, all right, this precinct right here arrested 500 people in 2019 and out of those 500 people 480 actually served time for their crime and this precinct arrested also 500 but only 200 served time for their crime so they got a bad rate rating or some shit i don't know if they do that but it seems like that's what, the, what that's what they do based on the things that be going on you feel what i'm saying like police harass harass me mad times for lord knows what like i like they just know me and they feel like, ah, right, yo, we're going to get some wreck today. We ain't have nothing to do today because Batman and Robin done for all the crime. So we just going to harass anybody that we see that we know from the neighborhood and shit like that. Feel what I'm saying? So that's why I said in the beginning, like, I feel like the police, they knew this dude. And they probably just wanted to mess with him. He's saying he just came from court. They obviously don't care. They, they like, yo, nigga, we came out here for ta target practice. We view the target today. We about to shoot the shit out of you. You better duck, run. Nigga, them niggas try to shoot you with that shit, nigga. You should have, you should have tried to run, nigga. Fuck that. <laughs> out of rest. Oh, shit. When the niggas would have shot me with that shot, through my body and did one of them roll shits. Got up out of there. Ran in my crib or some shit. Jumped out the back window or some shit. Know what I mean? But the thing about it, if this is where he lives at, why the police there? Do you got a warrant? What, what made them come and be ready? Like, they squatted up. Like, you can see, like, they got... They call lined up and shit. Like, they were ready for him or some shit. Like, did he do something? Did they follow him there? Like, how did they get there? And how is he outside with all his kids? And what happened? What's the backstory behind all that shit? But, like, 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 all you people that like to say, Oh, all right, yo, police be shooting people fairly and da 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 Tell me what part about this was fair. What are you telling me now? Oh, no, he should have just laid on the floor and don't move. Yo, bro, before he even got the chance to lay on the floor, he got shot. He had his hands up, and that's something that you know to do. Put your hands up, because they always tell you that shit. So you put your hands up, and he get shot. Now you scared for your life, because you're like, all right, they shot me. He probably didn't even know they shot him with a rubber bullet. You feel me? At first, he probably thought he got shot with a real gun until he noticed. You feel what I'm saying? So now you panicking already and you scared because you see what's going on, on on the media and shit. You see people getting killed by police, especially of your color. So you you worried on the floor and they just practicing keeping shooting. You feel me? Anyway, all you coons that be saying, that be trying to defend the police. All right. Some police is not. Some police is, is cool. You know what I mean? They do their job. They go to work to serve and protect. Some of these guys, they actually go to work like it's a video game or some shit. They go to play. They don't go there to do what they actually swore that oath for you. Feel me? They take advantage of the power they have and shit like that. Feel me? And that's this this right here is a prime example of that shit. But everybody comment in the comment section below. Let me know what you feel about the whole situation. Let me know if you want to see me do more reactions to videos like this or whatever. It's your boy Upper Class. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. After you subscribe, remember this. Whenever you watch my videos, it's all jokes, man. You gotta come over here and get a laugh. Don't hate me because I gave you a low rating. Hate yourself because you ain't make a fire song. <laughs> it's your boy BMG, man. Good. Bow.